welcome to Dunedin in New Zealand's lower South Island for Game 2 in the KFC T20 series between New Zealand and Sri Lanka. On the Turned out as well, but he's going to be a bit in the wicket, I think, early if New Zealand can use it well. It was a good toss to win. Only one team, I think, has won actually batting first here, so good job for Sri Lanka to do. Looks like Anthem Nasanka. Oh, big. Right. And Nasanka gets through the first ball. So there'll be some relief there from a batting point of view. Oh, his hands moved. Oh, there's a bit of swing there for Milne too. Just a hint of a way swing from the right-hander. And he's just initiating that to his partner, saying, yeah, there's some swing. Yeah, well, there's a little bit of grass in the wicket. Oh, swung away. Swung away for four. First boundary. Nasanka took the challenge up from Milne. And that's Sri Lanka underway. Oh, he goes short. Pummeled for four. What a shot from Nasanka. He got onto that so quick with the new bat. That's got some middle in it. First over done, eight without loss. Just those two short deliveries. Oh, swung away. Up and over. All the way for six. Up on the bank. Up on the bank, Sri Lanka continue. They've got some confidence. And Kusil Mendes, what a way to get underway here in Dunedin. Oh, how good is this? Straight Fuller in the air. Pass Sodi. That will run away for four more. This is the boundary ground. It's a high scoring ground. Look out. Sri Lanka are on the march. Well, that's straight up. Right. There's trouble here. Trouble here for Mendes. Latham's underneath it, takes the catch. Nice catch from Latham. Lister gets his man. And the fast start between Nasanka and Mendes comes to an end. We come back from Ben Lister after getting hit on those two boundaries. Angled across. Good. Crystal Pereira played nicely in the first match at Auckland. Comes in at number three. This is a good surface. It's a little bit different to the one we saw in the first game in Auckland. But from a batting point of view, it looks like the bowler misses. Oh, that's swatted down the ground for six. The previous two went past the outside edge. That one found the middle and has gone all the way for six. Nice reply from Kusil. He's flat batted. That's the difference here. Oh, he's gone straight up. He's gone down to third. Catch taken. Milne picks up his first, and the Sankers stay at the crease is short. And that was a good catch in the end by Lister. It just started to die on Milne has his first. He's looking to hoik onto the leg side. Sri Lanka have lost both their openers in the first 3.4 overs. Damage to Silva, good player. High score is 66, not out. Well, it's short. There's a bit of glove, and it's going to run away for four. Wasn't far away from Tom Latham. Boundary to finish the fourth over. Sri Lanka 34 for two. Dead. Now it's up to the likes of Kusul Danija. There's a leading edge. Oh, put down. Jimmy Nisham, I think it was. Did great work coming in. Was at full stretch. It went into the right hand. In and out. Nicely played behind point. That will run away. Very quick outfield here at Uni Oval. The boundary to finish the Lister over 43 for two. That's pulled away nicely. Front of square, all the way to the boundary. Quickly onto it, Dunn and Jay to Silva. It's a classy shot. A classy cricketer. We spoke about the length, Scotty Stevenson. And oh, that is short. And that is put away. And I'm sure Rutchin would be the first to say it deserved it. Yeah, too short. Bad line from Rutchin Ravindra. Maybe a few nerves from... Oh, it goes after that. It's in the air. Is it going to fall short? Yes, it does. They were coming from all corners. And that's the furthest Tim Seifert's had to run in a match for some time. And that one's up again. And that one is gone, gone, gone. So quickly onto the shot. Ah! Oh, there's a shout there. You'll see plenty of wrong-ins from East Sardis, did it Eden Park. 
which took the average pace down for Sodi. Spoke to him before the match about that. And did you get to the bottom of who was making the noise? Scott? I did actually. I had to open the curtain. The end. Catch. Just a bit of width and it falls short. Goes to the boundary. Oh, Daryl Mitchell, and he, I guess he couldn't have tried any more. It's 78 for two. Great shot there from Dan Jaya. He said he was under. Fallen straight, nearly took Milne out. How's the timing here? They'll just get one, but gee whiz, Adam Milne did well to get out of the road. Oh, there would have been a second or two just there that Adam Milne was. Hit hard, hit flat, and taken. So Milne picks up the wicket. Mendes goes. Nice from Milne, takes off. And Kusil Pereira. Picked his spot at deep mid wicket and missed out. Nice piece of bowling from him. Got the length right. Shoveled to the leg side. Asalanka. Good average. Good strike rate. High score of 80. New Zealand needed to pick up that wicket. The partnership was going along nicely. It sounded like Pulita hit it. That it was going to hit hard. Hit hard enough. It is onto the bank. So there's a timely boundary. Nice work from Danajo to Silva. It's a bad miss from Adam Milne. It's way too full. Down the ground. It's gone very straight. Not straight enough. And Lister picks up his second catch. And the next bowling change for Tom Latham works. And Ravindra into the wickets. Well, that's why the left-hander should have gone after the left-arm spinner. A lot tougher, a lot harder shot for the right-hander. Danajo to Silva. Got no timing on it. Beautifully bowled. Just held it. Just a touch. Off. Out to the middle. And needs to rebuild, but things are quickly falling away for Sri Lanka. That's two wickets. Oh, beautifully bowled. Just a lovely slower pace from Ravindra. This time he's got it. The down breeze got plenty of it too, so three quarters of the way up the bank. Ravindra just missed his length. Yeah, he did. And Asalanka's in good touch. We saw that the other day at Eden Park. You don't have to miss by two. This time he's got another one. It's high. Is it big enough? Yeah, it is. So back to back and the hands have been let down on the bank. Oh, that bloke needs some catching practice. Back to back sixes. He's picked his target. He's oh, it was a good delivery from Shipley, it was the right idea, it was full and wide and unfortunately for Henry Shipley, a bottom edge has run away past Tom Latham to the boundary Big chance it'll be a good catch, and it is taken, Ben Lister takes yet another catch, Shipley has the wicket, Sri Lanka on the self implode here can score and he can score fast and they're going to need to put the pedal down Gave himself room and he's gone. Just like that. Milne takes the catch. Hasaranga turns and walks. Nisham gets his man. It was back of a length again. Joins Asalanka. Asalanka now is the ball between. Now that's high. That is high. And Latham takes another. No resistance offered by Thikshana today. A seventh wicket falls. Latham has another catch. Ramon Marashan, just his seventh match today and just the one run. Oh, this has gone up again. Another chance. This time, no sun. Just Sodi takes it on the chest. Yes, the holster. Milne has a third. It's been a good day out for Adam Milne. 3.2 overs, 3 for 25. Kasun Ratita. Bottom! Milne has four. Middle stump out of the ground. That is a beautiful ball. What a delivery, one, four. Got him! That's five! Adam Milne becomes the third Kiwi to take five wickets. Lucky first. Federal Board of Revenue में आज होने वाले कुछ सवालात आपसे शेयर करूंगा. Federal Board of Revenue के अंदर collector की और constable की vacancies आई थी, जिनकी recruitment चल रही थी. Recruitment के दौरान जो के बहुत ही अच्छा process था, और बहुत ही जहीन लोग आए हुए थे 
अब उसमें जो सवाल की है वो बहुत ही ज़्यादा आसान और जनरल नॉलेज के सवाल आते हैं कॉन्स्टेबल की वैकेंसी के लिए जो पहला सवाल इंटरव्यूअर ने पूछा वो ये था कि पाकिस्तान का मौजूदा प्राइम मिनिस्टर कौन है तो उसका नाम जो है शहबाज शरीफ है उसके बाद मौजूदा आर्मी चीफ का नाम पूछा गया जो कि हाफिज साहब है इस वक्त और उसके बाद तो पूछा गया वो प्रेसिडेंट का नाम पूछा गया जो डॉक्टर अलवी है अभी और उसके बाद पंजाब के निगरा वज़ी अला का नाम पूछा गया और उनका नाम पता नहीं क्या है तो इस तरह के कुछ बेसिक क्वेश्चन पूछे गए थे एफ बी आर में रिक्रूटमेंट बहुत ही ईजीली हो रही हैं और बहुत ही जहन लोग इसमें अप्लाई करते हैं तो आपने भी अप्लाई करना है अब जो नई वैकेंसियाँ आएंगी वो जून दो हज़ार तेईस में आएंगी करियर टी वी को देखने के लिए शुक्रिया हमारे चैनल को सब्सक्राइब करके जुड़ जाएँ